G'day guys and welcome back to the channel. So today what I want to show you guys is <clears throat> this new OpenAI's chat GPT AI engine. It's quite amazing at what it can do. In today's episode I want to show you guys how by just simply typing in a few words into chat GPT's AI model what it can do and how we can actually create a Python um, weather app just by simply typing in what we actually want it to do. So let's let's begin. So first off to actually use um, chat GPT you have to register, log in. I mean I've already done that so you guys can get, get to that yourselves. I'll just jump in here and start the AI engine. And right now um, what I want to do is create a weather app um, where a user enters in the city and the country. Also, I actually wanted to use um, Python's um, GUI Tkinter, which is the graphic user interface. Um, it makes it look a little bit more cleaner and user friendly. And I also wanted to have some sort of validation where if the actual city is not actually um, spelled correctly, that means it won't bring, bring back any um, results and give the user some more validation saying hey you've actually entered in the wrong city or the city doesn't exist so um, let's go for it I've actually just copy and pasted the actual request that I want so here create a Python program to tell me the current temperature in a city by asking the user to enter the city and country if the city is not found please advise the user using tkinter please advise user Using Tkinta also make the screen size 350 pixels by 100 pixels. So I'll just hit the play button now here and you can watch it do its magic. The only requirement here, we have to um, just sign up to Open Weather Maps um, site to get our own uh, API key, which is pretty, pretty simple and straightforward. Sometimes uh, I've noticed when it's writing out code, it might not complete the actual code. So all you need to do is jump back into the box here and just type in finish off your code and um, it'll complete it. Let's see now if it, that happens or it doesn't. Looks like it's working fine now. Yeah, it's fine. So. Now we can copy the code, jump into any um, Python editor that you currently use. I use PyCharm, so so I'll paste the code in here, get my API key which I've already entered here. This is where you would enter your API key. Now let's run this. Okay, you can see the title of the app is the weather app and you can see from the window title it's weather app so we can change this to wherever we want so we can say city weather app for example city weather app and you can see that if we run it again it will show city weather app so let's first off try the validation it's GT obviously is not a city so we'll hit Get temperature. No, oh, maybe CGT is a city. City not found. Let's try Bangkok, Thailand. Get temperature. There we go. Twenty-seven point six degrees Celsius. We can see that we are using degrees Celsius here. We can obviously change that to Fahrenheit if need be. And you can see that it is a quite a simple um, app that Chat GTP, GPT creates, which is quite amazing. And for the next video, 
I'll show you how to export this into an executable file which you can run on any uh, PC. Thanks for watching guys and good luck.